we are at the Toronto Fan Expo, and I have the lovely Brittany to catch. Brittany, could you tell me about uh, yourself and what you're doing here? Sure. I am with Trios College. So we're a college in Ontario. We have nine locations, and we offer video game design and development. Very cool. It's one of our biggest programs, so that's why we're here today. It's a perfect audience to talk about it. Very cool. Mm -hmm. And uh, what is it you're demonstrating here? So this is our uh, st state-of-the-art Alienware laptop, and all of our students get one of these in their program. So it's a beautiful thing. And playing right now on the screen is actually an app that our students developed, our graduates. Three of them were working in the, they were interns at this company, and they were all three were hired on, and they created this game called Zip Zap. Zip Zap. Zip Zap. Is it available on the internet? It is. It's actually like the number one of the number one games in Canada right now. Really? Yes. That's pretty darn impressive. Designed by our And grads. a couple of your students, while they were students? No, they now they're graduates oh, okay. and they're working for this company and oh, they okay. created it. Very cool. Yeah. Um, you said they were interns there first? Yes, they were. So every one of our programs has a four month internship with it. Mm -hmm. And what's the total overall time of the program? It's two years. Two years. Very cool. Where it's, are you located? So we have campuses spanning from Oshawa to Windsor. Our gaming campuses are in Hamilton, Mississauga, Toronto, and where else? What am I missing? Kitchener and London. Excellent. <laughs> yes. Um, very, very, uh, very cool. Yeah. Beautiful and areas. I'll, I'll tell you about um, our two-year programs are really great for the industry because um, we were talking to a lot of the the, uh, the companies and they were saying that. Graduates who go, who come from universities, they're spending four years in the industry, and by the time they finish, the, the skills that they learned in the first year are now obsolete because the industry is changing so quickly. So that's why our two-year programs are absolutely fantastic for students. Very cool. Mm -hmm. Now, um, I like to end my interviews by giving the person I'm interviewing the chance to tell me something weird and wonderful about themselves or okay. their program. Right. And you were telling me something. Uh, before we started the interview, um, would you like to tell me uh, about the uh, app con or app? Uh, sure. App so <laughs> it's called the Great Canadian Appathon, and it's happening at the end of September. If you Google it, you'll be able to find it. I don't know the actual URL, but um, it's a 48-hour competition where our students they go, they go into the campus, and they um, are given a theme. So it's, it's sponsored by XMG Studios. They give them the theme of, say, sports, and they have to design a game within that 48 hours. So it's a really great, they, they eat there, they sleep there, everything at the campus. So how long, or uh, how many people compete in this? Hundreds. It's gone all across Canada now. Really? Yeah. It's and a really great thing. So you draw people from everywhere to your campus here? Well, there's hubs all ev everywhere across Ontario oh, okay. and Canada. And then we have our own hub within Kitchener. So people can come to it if they like. Oh, I see. So yeah. how, many, how many people do you normally have come for here? Well, we've had several. Um, our last, I think, brought about maybe 100 students or so. Uh-huh. Yeah. Very cool. Do great. they work in teams or do they work separately? They do. They work in teams. Usually they have someone who is focusing on sound, someone who's focusing on the design, and then someone who's focusing on the development aspect of it. And tell me something about yourself in terms of uh, your relationship with the video games. Sure. Well, I'll tell you something that's a little bit fun and quirky about that's, me. That's, that's perfect. <laughs> Um, on the, I work at Trios College, but on the weekends I actually dress up as a princess and I go to little girls' birthday parties. Awesome! So, I've, uh, I'm Cinderella, Sleeping Beauty, Ariel, all those fun princesses. I can see that. You're a beautiful lady. And, uh, oh, thank you. Uh, so you're also a cosplayer. <laughs> yes, I am. Yeah. And next year I'm dressing up for sure. Awesome. <laughs> Do you go to any of the other... Uh, uh, anime and such conventions? No, I've never been as a princess, but I need really? to. I need to go. You would be the belle of the ball. <laughs> Thank you. Thanks. Thank you very much. Thank you. And from Toronto, Ontario, the Plan Expo, this has been the Weird Review. Thanks so much. <laughs>